Now that you've found a property you like, let me guide you through the offer process with ShopRop and discuss the risks associated with removing contingencies. Our rebate program is applicable to any home listed on any site, providing you the largest rebate in the industry. First, if you're interested in requesting a property value estimate and having us review the disclosures for you, you can do so by clicking Request Property Value on your dashboard or including it within the Make an Offer Request form on your dashboard. However, please note that we typically do not review disclosures or provide property value estimates until you have seen the property and are ready to write an offer as it requires time and effort. When you're prepared to proceed with an offer, simply use the Request Property Value option on your dashboard or incorporate it directly within the Make an Offer Request form to receive this information. Before we even draft the offer, we'll reach out to the listing agent to express your interest, inquire about potential competing offers, and gather any additional insights. During this conversation, we'll also check if the property has a review date and whether the seller is open to considering offers before that date, if applicable. Keep in mind that for an offer to be accepted before the review date, it's generally expected to be significantly above the list price and completely non-contingent. If you're not interested in submitting an offer before the review date, we will typically prepare the offer closer to the review date. This approach allows us to gather updated information about the competition, ensuring that we can make the most informed decision possible when finalizing your offer. When you submit an offer on a home, you'll also provide earnest money, which is a good faith deposit that demonstrates your commitment to the transaction. Your earnest money is typically due one to two days after the seller accepts your offer. It's protected by contingencies, which we'll discuss next. There are three main contingencies, and additional ones may apply, such as septic, if relevant. The primary contingencies are inspection, appraisal, and financing. Inspection contingency. This gives you the right to inspect the property and ask for credits, repairs, or both. If the seller does not agree, you can cancel the transaction and get your earnest money back within the specified time frame. If you remove this contingency, you're waiving the right to do an inspection or ask for repairs and credits. Appraisal Contingency. This allows you to ask the seller to lower the purchase price to the appraised value or negotiate a different price. If you waive this right and the appraisal comes in low, you're committing to make up the difference between the appraised value and the purchase price. If you don't close because of a low appraisal, you would lose your earnest money. Financing Contingency. This states that you'll make a good faith effort to get a loan, and if you can't, you should get your earnest money back if you've fulfilled the contingency requirements. If you waive this contingency and can't get a loan, you're agreeing to lose your earnest money. In competitive markets, buyers often waive all contingencies and release the earnest money to the seller. Earnest money, typically 3 to 10% of the purchase price, stays at escrow until closing. Releasing the earnest money to the seller right away serves as a strong incentive for them to accept your offer, as they receive the money immediately instead of waiting for closing. If you don't close, they can put their property back on the market and already have your earnest money. However, there are risks involved. For example, the seller might not close and you would have to take them to court to resolve the issue. Though this has not happened in our experience, it's essential to be aware of the risk. Another potential issue is that the seller owes more money on the property than what they are selling it for. Reviewing the preliminary title can help identify any outstanding mortgages, reducing some of this risk. Rob Luke Sr. has a video on how to review title on our YouTube channel. Once you've decided on your offer terms, we'll prepare the contract and send it to you for electronic signatures. With ShopRop, you're one step closer to securing your dream home. Reach out anytime. We're here to discuss your offer terms and ensure the best deal possible.